Here we are again, another cooking with Kathy. Oh, you just never know what happens in this kitchen, I tell ya. But anyway, today I'm gonna do the simplest of simple breakfasts. So I've done some stuff pre before, like I've, pre I've prepped. I like to prep some things to make things easy on myself. So what I've done, I've actually cooked up just some ground beef and then I stick it into some silicone mold molds. I don't know if I can find them real fast. There they are, like these. So just silicone mold, molds that I got off of Amazon. And I put the ground beef in that I've already fried and cooked up in there. Top it with bacon fat, because I always have tons of bacon fat. And then freeze it. How simple is that? So that I w when I want to use it, all I have to do is pick it out of this bag from the freezer. And depending on how hungry I am, then I'll take either a lot or I'll take just a little bit of it. You know, half of it maybe, something like that, or maybe a whole one. But actually today I'm pretty hungry and I think I want one that just looks like it's got lots of meat in it. So I'm going to take the whole thing. I don't actually measure it when I put it into these silicone molds. I just put the meat at the bottom, however much I think. I've actually half sort of measured that. So it's only about an ounce to two ounces in each one, something like that. Top it with the ground beef. So if you want to measure, go for it. I like to keep things simple as we all know. <laughs> simple, simple. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to melt that. It doesn't take very long to melt. And after it's melted, yeah, I use fingers. Oh my goodness, I don't worry about burning fingers too much. I've been cooking for a long time. My way. <laughs> I don't actually use recipes a whole lot. I, although I will look at recipes and then I just kind of go with the flow. I have found some excellent recipes on Ketogenic Woman. I've looked at some from Maria Emmerich. I look at some from Dr. Lisa Wiedemann. I've looked at some from Kelly Hogan. There's so many great recipes out there. And um, there's a couple others. Can't remember the one guy's name, whatever, something about Nashville. Um, but anyway, lots of great uh, recipes and cooks out there. I'm not a cook, I'm just somebody that eats carnivore. How simple is that? Okay. Now it's getting to the stage I actually need a spatula because now I don't stick my finger in <laughs> and it's too hot. So I'm just going to melt that down. And what I want to do is I want to absorb the fat and I also want to have some more protein in there. A couple of eggs, simple enough for me. Crack them open. One, there you go. One. And the other one is going to crack the neck. And two. And then I'm just going to actually mix the whole thing up. I know some, some people like to cook the white a bit more and then scramble in the, the yellow, the yolk. But um, I just cook it all up. Again, simple is better. That's sort of how that is. I never timed this. I should have timed myself. Actually, the timer is on the clock. But... Within just a couple of minutes, you've got yourself a delicious breakfast. It doesn't take much longer than pouring out a bowl of cereal or whatever other crappy food you could eat. And maybe, maybe I shouldn't call it crappy in that if you were starving, you were hungry, that might be a good thing. So here you go. Breakfast for today. Simple, easy, no excuse breakfast. You've got the time. Don't say you have, don't have the time and don't say you don't have the money because that was cheap. Have a great day. Bye for now.